Hi friends, welcome back to Mangalore and Taste Buds Basha. Today I'll show you how I make aloo roast or potato roast. This is a no onion, no garlic dish. This recipe is quick and easy to prepare and serve. Whenever you crave for something spicy on a plate, I make this. This is also a no onion, no garlic recipe. Every household has their own way of preparing this dish. You can serve this with rotis, paratas as well as with sambar rice, dal rice. Makes it into our lunch box very often. You can use baby potatoes also. We like this dish a bit spicy and hot but you can reduce the spices as per your preference. So let's check out the ingredients. If you are new to my channel a warm welcome. If you haven't subscribed to my channel please do subscribe. If you like this recipe of mine do give a thumbs up. And if you have tried this recipe, please leave a comment in the comment section below. So let's get started. Here I have to taken four, four potatoes, boil, cut it into wedges and just boiled it with a little salt. Do not overcook them. Take oil as required in a pan. Add one teaspoon of cumin seeds, one teaspoon of anise seeds, a few curry leaves. Once they crackle, add one teaspoon of hing or asafoetida. Fry till it releases a nice aroma. Now add 1 teaspoon of coriander seeds powder, half teaspoon of turmeric powder. See that the spices don't burn. 1 teaspoon of chili flakes and 1 teaspoon of chili powder. Give it a nice good mix and then Add the potato wedges and now gently toss it till all the spices are coated with the potatoes. Be gentle when you are mixing it. You can use butter instead of oil also. If you wish you can use garlic and onions. Add 1 teaspoon of kasuri methi. And now keep on tossing it till it gets nice crispy on the outside. I have added around 2 to 3 green chilies. It enhances the taste of the potatoes. Do give it a try. I am sure you too will enjoy this yummy potato roast. Thanks for watching. Please like, and sh like share and subscribe to my channel. And do not forget to click the bell icon to get notified as and when I upload a new recipe. The list of ingredients is given in the description box below. So my dear friends, hope you have enjoyed this quick and yummy recipe. Stay tuned for more such interesting recipes. Till we meet again, check out my other recipes at Mangalorean Taste Buds by Asha. Bye, see you soon with a new interesting recipe. Take care.